All right, let's go up here and, well, not up here. Let's go over to the engineer station and we'll turn on, actually in the options, let's talk about the options. So we got cold and dark. We can do it with engines running, change the time to Zulu. We can disable the copilot co callouts. We can hide the yokes. We can change the weight to kilograms. We can disable the weight and balance for FS economy and we can connect ground power. So we're gonna go ahead and connect ground power and we can turn f maintenance and failures on or off, change our sounds, and uh, we'll bump those up for right now. And yeah, so external power on. Let's turn the battery on and close the guard. Nope, oh, soundboard's dead right now. Really? Yep. So I'll give you minimum input on this. I'll just let you do your... I'll let okay. you do something wrong. Yeah, if I have questions, I'll, I'll ask. <laughs> I'm bound to do something wrong, actually. Let me see if this works. So many buttons. So many buttons. I mean, yeah, we do get bored, but... I also try to entertain. Okay, the sounds are back. Okay. Alright, Max, what do you think of the engineer station? No, no, seriously, what do you think of the engineer station, Max? Serious, Max. Uh, uh right, I, I, yeah, yeah, I, I love, love it. it. I, 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 I love it. I, um, I'm not a, you know, love at first sight kind of guy, but I think I, think I have kind of changed my view on that one. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, All right. it sounds like it's down. coming in twice. It, it was for a moment, yep. So let's uh, start the APU. Oop, 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000. Hopefully that kicks on. Yep, it is. We got uh, EXH. Temperature rising. Omelets, beacon, pancakes, and Twitch. Best Sunday ever. Yes. It's not bacon, it's beacon. You know, if I just switch it to FJM, I could do Flying Jackal Miles. You should do Flying Jackal Miles. It's actually <laughs> catching on. I've I've caught three other flight simmers that are now not only doing Fly Miles for their channel, but they're also doing Roulette, which is great. Roulette's fun, yeah. All right, so uh, APU is still rising. There we go. It's dropping down the temperature. And wait. When I want to do an APU gen close, do I want to trip it or just want to go up to close? Oh, there we go. Close. I think we're good now, right? Or no? Okay, back over here. APU bleed is this one over here. There's the APU bleed. I'll turn the uh, fuel pumps on. Aft, forward. Aft, forward, boot pumps. Um, so Jack, got a question. Yes? I'm looking at the fuel pumps, just below the fuel pumps. We have the cross feeds, right? I saw someone the other day that said you turn those to cross feed and then the blue light comes on and it goes off. Is that normal? Or yeah, the blue light is just says the val valve in transit. But so that, the, the blue light coming on just says the valve is in transit. All right, so... Okay, so they're closed, so they're not they're not continuing that. And that's a proper procedure is to close those cross no, you feeds? Can no, keep them all open. You keep them open? Because this guy said yeah. you had to close them. No. The default's closed. Or, sorry, the default is open. Yeah. So just leave it and at default. So Don't do anything with it then. Yeah, keep them open. Okay. Modify my checklist. It's uh, differing in SOP. Okay. 
Now, if I turn external power off, ooh, it automatically kicked to off when I closed the uh, APU or something, I think. Okay. Let's turn the galley power on so we can get our Kraken bean brewed. And the cargo... Well, galley power uses a lot of power. You won't be able to ch power the galley off the APU. Oh, really? So I better change that then. So the galley should come after engine start. So no Kraken can be made until the engine has started. Okay, I guess I'll hold off on getting mine. <laughs> SOPs and SOB. Can we find your checklist anywhere? Yes, Epic Nobody. My checklists are on my Discord server, and there's a room that says JF underscore checklists. So if you want to join my Discord server, type in exclamation Discord in the chat, and you'll get a link invite. All right, cargo outflow heat to normal, and we want to do Gasper fan on, and we want to do the packs on left and right. And then we want to open the bleeds. Because I ain't got time to bleed. Ooh. Pressure panel. We're going up to one nine or zero. So I'm changing this pressure panel to one nine zero. Our landing altitude. Uh, Six eighteen. So let's do our landing altitude. Oops. Six eighteen. Uh, mini webs. Question is, are you going to dish out the sweet JFM for the? F yes. I yes. Can confirm Razor USA. JFM add mini webs. 40,000 John Fly miles. Razor JFM add uh, Razor 40,000 JFM 40,000 JFM Congratulations. Okay, pressure panel, pressure panel is set. We're then going to go down to the lower engineer panel and we're going to turn on the hydraulics on and system A and B and we'll cl uh, open the uh, ground interconnect. Come back over here to the upper overhead and we'll change our auto brakes you don't to, need to open the ground interconnect. Rejected takeoff. Okay, so the ground interconnect can doesn't go on then until when? Doesn't, doesn't need to be on. All right, close that. Get rid of that. Emergency exit lights. The ground interconnect allows right. you to move the nose wheel if you need to taxi. But okay. other than that, you're good to go. You don't need to. It's more for... Okay. Good to know. No smoking on. Fasten seatbelt signs coming on. Because we're getting ready to push back. Uh, we'll turn on the uh, window heat. On, on, on on the beacon light will come on now let's see if this works Psst. turn beacon light on set beacon light on beacon lights on set beacon light on beacon lights on plane command show feedback tune radios volume level voice select Ooh. This might kill us, so let's try it. Plan command. Read back commands. Tune radios. Yeah. Is taxi light on? Starting engine 2. Oh, don't start engine 2. Starting engine 2. <laughs> Whoa. Alright, we'll do beacon light. <laughs> I know somebody. No. Yeah. <laughs> Start making it on Starting engine two. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> <That's> so funny. <laughs> Navigation uh, lights on. 
uh, we'll set our altitude. <laughs> Let's see if this works. <laughs> set altitude 19,000. Altitude 19,000 feet. I think uh, the cracking got brewed early for your co-pilot there. <laughs> Beacon light on. Starting engine 2. <laughs> Someone's got to clip that. <laughs> J-Snap will love that moment. <laughs> I'm using a program called Plane Command, and it's working a lot of the time. <laughs> But the last two flights, it had a few issues. Oh, man. Bring the guy back. He had more idea of what was going on. You, you shouldn't have to flip through every altitude like that. Switch it's a new mode. thing with plane command. It's it's What it is is it's, oh. it's simulating the guy rotating the, with his fingers. Oh, that's yeah. crazy. Yeah. Okie dokie. <laughs> it's in beta, so we're, 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 uh, we're feeding back information. All right, altitude is set. Uh, let's set uh, our barrel. Uh, set altimeter three zero one seven. Altimeter three zero one seven. We'll set set our standby to also three zero one seven. That's close enough. And the first officer side is three zero one seven. What airport are you taking off at? Uh, this is uh, Branson, Springfield, Missouri. Oh, is that 1,300 feet? Wow. Is it? Yeah, 1268. All right, that is set. Uh, nav radios are set. Uh, heading is set. Let's do... We should do our FMC programming right now. Before, yeah. There we go. FMC. All right. So again, hold down Alt and hit F. It comes up with our menu. By the way, this plane is on sale. It's on sale right now. And if you buy it, I will give you forty thousand jumping miles, which is good toward prizes. We're giving away planes today. We're giving away the Turtle Beach Pro tournament headset it's a $200 headset we're giving away today giving away gift certificates to the org store it's a party we're giving we're not giving away Kraken though all right route let's do flight plan origination is Kilo Sierra Golf Foxtrot and we're going to Kilo Sierra Tango Lima and our first waypoint will be Almond, so Uniform, Lima, Mike, Alpha, November, right there. And next page we'll do, well, we can do Execute, that's fine. Uh, we're going to go... Too. I'm going to watch you attentively here. J105. You're going to watch me attentively? Yeah, I need to learn how to use this FMC too. There you go. To Whiskey, Echo, Lima, Tango, Sierra... Welts, and then um, <laughs> execute, and then we're going to go to cruise. We're going to put in one nine or zero as our flight level. Go to our legs page. Check for any discontinuities. We got SGF, Ullman, Elsto, Welts. Looks good. We'll then do uh, KSTL uh, arrival. Um, let's take a look at four flight and see what. The winds could change while we're in flight, but, um, oh, let me change something here. The four flight. Most connection. Take, take care, Watt. Thanks for joining us. You're going to have to stay up now, many Yeah. Sorry for keeping up. It is, it is, it is late there. Very late. Like 2 a.m., right? So on the four flight view, if we go to KSTL, uh, right now in St. Louis, the winds are 100 at 7, visibility 10, statute, few at 6,000, few at 25,000, temperature 26, dew point 3019. And uh, yeah, with the winds being one zero zero at seven, 
It looks like ILS uh, 6 would be our choice at the present moment. We'll re-verify that in cruise, but let's do ILS 06. And uh, let's take a look at our, well, let's look back at 45. We'll look at the options for the ILS. So we'll go procedures, approach, ILS 6. Um, yeah, FTZ would be perfect. So FTZ, we'll select that. And we'll click add to route. That'll be perfect for a transition on into the ILS. So back on the FMS, we're going to choose FTZ transition and execute. We'll go back to our legs page. We'll bring up FTZ so we don't have any discoms. And we're good to go. Uh oh, Taco's having a problem with the 732. Is it that APU issue? Uh, no, no, no. He's having an issue where it, he put the 732 folder in his aircraft folder, but it's not showing up. I think he may have a zip inside a zip or a folder inside a folder. So make sure when you open up the 732 oh. folder that you have the objects folder and a few of those it, other. In X Plane 11, it might come up as an unidentified aircraft or unknown aircraft. It might be at the very bottom of your list. So in my case, if I type in 732, seven, if I type in 732 in the search engine, it comes up as an underscore FJS unclassified. Yeah. So type in 732 up here, but also check to see, uh, I'll show you here on stream, because this is, this is, we're all about the tech support on this channel. So if I hit uh, C X plane 11 aircrafts and I go to tube, 732 Twinjet, it's got to have that right there. It can't be a folder inside a folder. It's got to go aircraft, where e tube is not necessary, obviously, but aircraft, fly JSIM, and then it's got to go right in here to the ACF file. And then you look for that unclassified. Or click show extra. Maybe that would work. No, you don't have to put it in the Laminar Research folder. No. All right, so we are, FMC is set. Um, today we're going to be taking off uh, in Springfield, Branson. We'll be taking off. Uh, the wind, the weather here is uh, 1104. The uh, preferred runway is not really in play. Given the fact that we're over here at the terminal, we can go uh, runway 14 or 32. Since we are traveling eastbound, probably should go 1 4. That'll work. So, I will set the heading bug to 1 4 0. Set heading 1 4 0. Heading 1 4 0 degrees. Beautiful. Let's do pushback. Let's see how the better pushback plug-in plays with this bad boy. All right, so we're going into the pre-planned stage. Oh, it already has a plan here from a... That's interesting. That's interesting. That must have been from... Yeah, it saves it. Yeah, that's cool. All right, let's just hit enter and we'll accept that. Ground to cockpit. Plan acknowledged. Call me through the menu when you are ready. And uh, we'll go... Push back, start push back. Ground to cockpit, toe is driving up. Uh, the giveaways aren't for a while, Miniweb, so I'd go to sleep if I were you. We do have giveaway qualifying happening for the Q400. You have to post a phrase, a post a phrase, yeah, post a phrase or, or interesting picture, an interesting phrase or interesting picture into the John Fly Discord. Under the Fly J Sim Q400 room, uh, we're also uh, we're going to be giving away 727, but that hasn't started yet. Let's zoom in on this operation, which I just love. Oh my gosh! Look at that thing; it's opening up. Okay, all doors and hatches are closed. Ready to connect. Set parking brake. Set parking brake. Oh baby, glow 
awesome alliance. Oh yeah. Hmm. It's raising it up. The whole entire plane is being raised up. Oh my gosh. Tow connected and bypass pin inserted. Release parking brake. Okay, let's go out here. Oh, snack. Starting pushback, and you may start engines. Okay, we're not going to start engines, because I want to enjoy the glory. Enjoy the glory. Oh, snack. Mm. Oh, but if you don't start the engines, I can't have my Kraken. You can't. <laughs> I know, I just, I'm, in, I'm in watching the beautiful pushback mode. It, 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 is, it is a pretty, it is a pretty awesome looking. Mm -hmm. Pilot Sage, isn't it? Uh, I don't have no idea what time the giveaways start, but it sounds like you know, be here for the fun of the flight, not the giveaway. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, giveaways, well, yeah, it'll be later. It'll be later, but. Uh, so, Jack, I have a quick question for you. Yeah? Um, do you like garbanzo beans? I'm not familiar with garbanzo beans. Okay. I was just curious if you liked garbanzo beans. I've heard the word before. Have you? Yeah. <laughs> we have a claim. Woohoo! We have a claim. We have a claim. Uh, garbanzo beans was the secret word uh, for Tony to claim today. He won a, a drawing yesterday, and the secret word was garbanzo beans that was going to be said today sometime during Operation the complete. So he claimed break. within two minutes of hearing that word, he won. So, the question I have for you. We got a sub crab. Oh, we have a sub crab. We got a sub crab. We got a sub crab. But the verse not coming. Disconnecting out. toe. Stand by. Nothing. Talk. Thank you for the sub crab. We got I a sub crab. I think the alerts crab. are on delay. But thank you, nothing. Talk. Or nothing, TOC, for the subscription. I really appreciate that. Hmm, it didn't come up. No, there it's a little bit uh a little bit borked right now. But thank you. Tony's on top of that, huh? <laughs> so Tony, here's your question. We're gonna spin for the amount of uh, gift certificate that you get today. So do you want the third spin, the fourth spin, or the fifth spin? That is my question. Oh, it's disconnected. I'm bypass pin has been removed. Hand signal on the left. We'll see you next time and have a safe flight. All right. Hand signal on the left. Thank you, too. Thanks for the tug. Let's have some coffee next week. All right. Let's come over here. I'm going to set up the spinner. So give me just a moment here before I start engines because we're in slow roll mode. You want the third spin? Okay. Okay, it's gonna. It's. I'm gonna do a test spin to make sure it shows up on screen, so this one doesn't count. Hold on. This one does not count. Don't worry. This is not the first one. You know, it's gonna be interesting if the alerts don't work, then maybe the spinner's not working either. So let's reset the bot. 
I love doing this. Is it the bot? Oh, uh, I lost money. Is, oh, roulette is working then. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it is a good looking livery. It's a very retro, beautiful livery. Audio's working, so that's good. Let's go down here, go here, grab that there. Let's see if it, this works now. This is just a test spin, this doesn't count. Test spin only. All right. All right, so here goes the first spin. He's either gonna get $15, 25 or 50 here for the Garbanzo secret word giveaway. Are you ready, Tony? One, two, three. First spin, doesn't count. Oh, baby, oh, baby. The anticipation. Second spin. And the third spin that actually counts is right now. Oh baby, get 50, get 50, get 50, get 50, get 50, get it, get it. Ah, 25, 25, 25. Congratulations, FSC Tony B. $25 gift certificate. That goes along with JSNAP also winning the gift certificate today. So Tony, congratulations. I'm writing that down. Thank you for playing. Thank you for paying attention to the stream. I bet you were listening for that garbanzo. Or someone texted you and said, he just said garbanzo. All right, let's go back into the sim, and let's go to the overhead. It went over my head. <laughs> yep. uh, let's do packs off over here. So packs coming to off position, and we're going to do galley is off. We don't need that because we haven't had them on. No cracking being made. Um, let's do, uh, let's go up here up to the top, and let's do... Uh, on engine number three. I'm going to click that to ground. We're going to then go down here and we're looking for that N2 percentage to rise. And then we'll add the fuel here in just a moment. Oh baby, I can hear it starting up. Uh, there's 20%. Let's add some fuel. Oh baby. Look at the uh, graphic detail here on this 727. It's on sale. Get it now, folks. This is a great plane. It's beautifully modeled. Yeah, it's it, yeah. You need it, three people to fly this plane, but yeah. Well, you don't really. I just landed up and was taxiing the terminal, and I heard you say, Jack, so do you like garbanzo beans? And I was like, I'm up! <laughs> yeah, that was funny. All right, let's start number two engine. Again, we're waiting for that N2 to rise right there, that little needle coming up. there. Now on the outside we should see some engine wash coming out. Oh baby baby. Oh yeah. Yep, stabilizing. Fuel flow looks good. 727 hype! That's about it. That's right. 
Welcome, Val dudes. Welcome, welcome. The bank would like to make an official announcement. How do they? How does the bank feel about all the John Fly miles that are being given away today? How, bank manager? How do you real? How do you really feel, bank manager? I, I really, I want to know what what sums up your feeling of giving away all of these miles. Oh well, that's just fantastic, isn't it? I lost everything. I can't hear you. What did What did you say? T tell me again. What you? What bank manager? What you? What you say? Oh well, that's just fantastic, isn't it? I lost everything. Lost everything. He's lost a lot of JFM today. But we've gained. We've gained also. All right, let's go up here and start number one. Isn't the start 312? I don't know. Is it? You mix it up, start what you didn't start last time, first time. Makes sense. Can you guys hear Darth Vader? He's joined me. Alright. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Okay, let's close the guards up here. So guard guards are closed. We then want to come down here and we want to go to the uh gens. Um, this is enhancing the blaze. And fields close. This is enhancing the blaze. And um Trip the APU. APU off. We can do APU bleed also off. And turn the uh, now we can turn the galley power on. The cracking can start being made. Yes. Es essential power on Gen 1. We'll turn the probe heat on, probe heaters on. The f uh, I turn the fuel heat on for this taxi. No, no. I do. No. That's what they said to do. No. No fuel heat? The, the, when do you okay, the, turn the fuel heat on? The problem with the fuel heat, and I haven't programmed it in, but if you're, your fuel temp should be around zero. You're okay. good if it's around zero. Because if you turn the fuel heat on, you'll you'll heat it up to forty, and it should ignite actually. But um, okay. Also, I, I noticed off. that when you bleed, you didn't turn off your other bleed air switch for the center engine number two. There's okay. two switches: so one on the left, one on the right. Okay, so we. Uh, okay, so we. Wait. Which one are you referring to? It's the ones that connect the center light to the left and the right. So you have one of them off, or one of them closed. Well, isn't that the APU bleed? No. Okay, so <laughs> it uses the same duct. The, a the engine 2 and the APU use the same duct. Okay, so I should go open on that then. And not close the APU bleed. Because I, I was told to close the APU bleed. Well, that's both of those switches. So should I close both of them? Close both the center switches, yeah. Really? Yep. So, en so you're only using bleed air from the left and the right engine. Okay. So, okay. That's good to know. So, bleed off on both. Yep. APU bleed and engine two off. All right. I'm going to make some modifications to my checklist. That's excellent information. All right. And, and then possible. essential power is set. Probe heat set. Okay. Oil. Uh, I was told to take oil cooler to flight. It could be normal, no. Oil cooler, you'd never have to change unless you're in a tricky situation. All right, got to get rid of that then. Squawk code today is going to be 6413. We'll squawk altitude. Let's do um, change the pressure over here to flight so we can start pressurizing the cabin. 
And we'll turn the taxi lights on. Let's see if the voice commands work now. Taxi light on. Taxi lights on. No, it doesn't do it. All right, flaps five. Let's try that. Uh, flaps two. Flaps going down to notch that two. That works. Notch two is five degrees. Trim. Uh, in this case, we come over here to our V card. Takeoff uh, trim should be 5.41. Now, this doesn't have the automatic trims, does it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, do you I just click on the green? Yep. Okay, I'm going to click on the green now. Oh, watch this. Click. Boom. That's. I love that. I love that feature. Automatic trim set. Uh, V1 is 114. VR 114. V2 126. That's for flaps 20, though. Hold on. I want to go flaps 5. Now I want to set it. There we go. Let's It'll go. be the same value. It moved it slightly. Because you're burning fuel. Ever so. Oh, okay. Okay, V-card can go down. Trim is set. Let's check our flight controls now. So, we're coming down here. Left, right, back, forward. Rudder pedal tiller looks good. Flight controls checked. Let's go ahead and taxi. Um, today's taxi will be brought to you by... Fly JSM, and we'll be going out to runway 32. We'll taxi out to terminal. We'll go on Echo. We'll then turn on, uh, yeah, we'll go turn on Uniform. We'll go then turn on November, and we'll then go Sierra to 32. Plan of attack. Release parking brake. Checklist check. Yeah, more coffee. I need, need more coffee. You actually might be want to set the trim again once you take off because it's it's based on your center of gravity, so you're burning off fuel as you taxi. Okay, good info. Let's give a little. Ah, oh, the Global Sim Alliance livery. Yes, I've successfully taxied the 727 so far. Stream is over. I'm done here. All my work is done. I like the smoke coming out of the back. It's the dirty engines. I mm. saw an MD take off two days ago, and they have, like, those JT-8Ds, even the one on the MDs, are really dirty. I like the dirt. I like the dirty. Yeah, button them up, gather the money, stick it in the bag. All right, good. All right, we're gonna turn left up here on, or no, we're gonna turn right on uniform. So far is the important part of the sentence, that's right. Subscribe. We got a subscribe. The alerts are we not got, working. We got a subscribe. We do have a subscribe. Crazy Diamond. Seven we got a months subscribe. in a row. Thank you, my man. We got a subscribe. Thanks for the seven months, man. I can't believe it's been seven months. I'm almost thinking that the alerts um, URL has changed or something. It's kind of weird. Uh, Crazy Diamond says, so dirty, Dan Creep. <laughs> we got a sub crap. That must be a emote. So dirty. Thanks for the sub crap. Alerts are broken. I don't know why. I don't know why. Whoop. Whoop. Let's do a test subscription here.
so there's the vents are back. The alerts are not working. Okay, hmm. hmm. we're crossing runway two. It's hard to taxi and do bot config, but we're having it. Look at the fuel panel. Stop, 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 stop. Yeah, we want to continue down Sierra. It's fine. Right, now let's test it. Trying to confirm mystery here. Um, just taking a second. This is a test. All right. Proper, proper alert. So dirty down creep. Dirty down creep. <laughs> Thank you, crazy. Sorry about that, not working. <sighs> it's weird. So what does the uh, fuels say? Where Where are the fuel? Where's the fuel panel? <laughs> You should never hear a captain say that. Not normally said while taxing. Jack, where's my fuel panel? Where's my fuel indicators? I forget. Are they at the... Do I have minus 1500 in each tank? What? What are you talking about? Where's what my fuel gauges? On the engine flight engineer panel? Right where those switches were? What's this minus 15? Is that below each of the gauges on the f below the yeah, fuel flow gauges? You did, you did forget to turn some of your fuel pumps on. Did I? Okay. Says the Make sure all the orange lights are out. Hello, Rudyism. Amber lights. All right, let's taxi into position. Where are you seeing negative 1500 though? Below the fuel flow gauges. And above the TCAS. Oh. Your dash 15, that indicates the type of engine you have on board. Oh, okay. You're in the date D, uh, JTAD dash 15 engines. It also tells me what plane you actually loaded up. All right, fuel quantity. What's wrong with my fuel quantity? They were they were giving me crap about my fuel quantity. I'm fine. It's a short flight. Yeah, you should have enough fuel. You got four thousand pounds in your left and right engine. And you got four thousand pounds across the board, so you got yeah. twelve thousand pounds of fuel. Yeah. I forgot left tank. Oh, the the pump. Yeah. All right, so let's continue down. Uh, we want to. Don't worry about the fuel heat. Uh, we're going to turn the taxi light off. And we're going to turn our strobe lights on. Inboard lights on. Um, we're going to set our speed. 210? Set speed 210. Speed 210 knots. And we're going to go uh, in IAS hold. When we engage the autopilot. I 
think we're ready to go. I think I think it's time to enhance the blaze. This is enhancing the blaze. <laughs> I can't do the pitch command. It won't move when I'm in uh, IAS mode, so that's fine. Well, uh, that's why you don't turn IAS mode on at first. Okay. Turn I just go pitch to ten degrees for your okay. uh, potential. All right, I'm not. I'm gonna be hand flying it anyway, though. So what does it matter? What's the first notch? Is that ten degrees or is that more? On that pitch, it's the fi every little deck thing is five. So it has, it has to go to the twelve o'clock position. All right. If I was gonna go into pitch control, but I'm gonna hand fly it for a little while. So like when you take off in this plane, it actually you don't actually need to set your pitch uh, per se on there when you take off. So what happens when you take off? The second you engage the auto auto autopilot, it actually syncs what your pitch and wing level is. So it'll keep you on that same pitch that you engage the autopilot at. So as long as you engage the autopilot at ten degrees, you're good to go. That was a really long-winded explanation. <laughs> and now... Let's do this. Let's light this candle. Parking brake is off. Engines are spooling. Oh, snack. We'll have a V1 call out. 80 knots. 80 knots. Roger. V1. V1. Rotate. Positive rate. To, uh, landing gear up. Landing gear going up. Oh baby. Oh my gosh, that is so beautiful. See ya, Springfield, Branson, Missouri. Catch you another time, another day, another frequency. Mm. Oh, that is juicy. All right, let's uh, let's go into uh, let's engage the autopilot. Let's go to IAS hold. 210. Set speed 210. Speed 210 knots. And let's go down here and we will sync up the heading bug. We'll go into heading select for a moment. Uh, we've just been given radar vectors to. Almond. So we're gonna turn, baby. Don't forget to alt select. Alt select is set right now. It's arm. Bam, shakalaga. Let's get another outside view. Oh, look at this. Yeah, flaps are flaps. cleaned up. Faps are cleaned up already. Faps. The fap. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that's what you said. Oh gosh. Oh, another yeah. flyby. I'm sorry, but I just love this flyby. So when you're ready, I can confirm Mystery 836. All right, just hold, give me a second for the confirms. Keep them, keep them fresh. Uh, all right, so we got a gear up. We got flaps are clean. We want to, to reduce the thrust now. Just a little bit. 
Oh yeah, baby. Freudian slip. <laughs> that could have been. Alright, so who do I give money to? Who am I giving JFM to? Oh, uh, Mystery836. What his name was? He's in the chat somewhere. Mystery, yep, with an I. Okay, 40,000. 40,000 given to Mystery836 for his purchase. What did he get? Uh, he purchased the... I swear to God, the 7-2. Nice, nice. All right, folks, so what I did wrong back in the day, in the early days, is I went into vertical speed mode in this plane, and I stalled and I crashed in the middle of downtown Los Angeles, live on Pilot Edge, near a taco stand, though, so the tacos were really good for those of us who survived the crash, which were nobody, but nevertheless, it put me on the map, and this, the video has been seen oh, numerous times. What's interesting about this situation is, is that it's trying to rejoin um, the original line. So watch this. I'm gonna. So that's one thing to learn, that if you take off and then you engage a FMS navigation, uh, uh, an LNAV situation, it's gonna go back to the original line that the FMS drew. So what I did there is I hit alt f because i've programmed alt f to do the fms cdu pop-up and i put ullman as the direct to and then i executed and that puts us on a more straight line from where we currently are to ullman i hope that makes sense can you link the video oh, i guess i could it's gonna be it i hope it's all video yeah i hope it doesn't bring back trauma but let's see john fly Trauma, you looked like you just uh, gave up. 727. It was classic. It uh, was. Yeah, here we go. 3,100 3, people have watched this debacle. What's your speed? What's your engine settings? Oh, gosh. I better check that. Um, I'm at uh, 206 EPR. 98%, 7%. I don't know. Everything is in the green. What do you 94. want it to be? Well, 92 is a good uh, climb. Uh, not yet. You see, you see the little dial. You're looking at that little dial. Okay. What little dial? In the middle of the N1 gauge. Oh yeah, I see that. Yep. And so set that to two. So yeah, 92. Oh, there we go. I never noticed that little dial before. Right there, guys. So I'm going to so bring 90, that back. 97 is your good takeoff. 92 is your good... Um, climb. Climb. Nice. All right. Well, here's the infamous uh, John Fly. You have to watch like freaking 30, 30 minutes of it, though, to get to the uh, good good stuff. Yeah, it's at the end. Yeah. You just got to go to the end. But what's part of it, it fun, uh, is watching the whole flight. It's very, very serious. Very serious. Very system check, pilot edge seriousness. And then all of a sudden, all hell breaks loose. Jessica wants more engine sounds. All right. I remember watching it the first time, and I was like, your speed is speed. I was looking at the speedometer, and obviously you weren't. And, no, I was not. Uh, I was in was like, leading chat mode. Off. Serious Gamer, what day did you buy it? What day did you buy it, Serious Gamer? Miniwebs has entered the Q400 giveaway. Nice, nice. Let's see who else is qualified. Yeah, peop there was people that were watching it. Oh, Miniwebs, I like that. I like that. That looks like this one. Let me grab it. Hold on. Miniwebs, here, here you go. This is for you. Woo. This is a Star Alliance Q400. How's the focus? The focus is not so good. We're flying this plane. The 727. Woo. Different livery, though. The computer flying says he's bought it today, but it has not given me or whispered me a order number yet. Computer flying. Please 
whisper me your last four digits of the order number, and I'll confirm that for you for your free yep. JFMs. Last four of the order number, and you will get JFM. All right, looks like, uh, oh, we've got a lot of qualifiers now. We got Laramie's. Imagine if you fall in love with someone and you find out she claps when the plane lands. I like that quote. Oh, overspeed. Reducing my throttles. It did not like the 92. We're at 515 knots. Well, that's because you leveled out and forgot to reset your thing. Yeah. I leveled out. I did indeed. So, hold the phones. What do I do here? So I'm going to go into... Can I hit the altitude on button? Altitude hold button? No, it's already holding from what I see. Okay. What you want to do is pull out some spoilers, though. Okay. I go full spoilers until you're out from auto, out from what you're doing. Well, I'd go idle throttle too until you're done with the overspeed, and then okay. figure out what you want your your germ. Okay, there's go. Maybe seventy or sixty percent might be good at this this altitude. Okay. Sixty percent on the N1. Yeah, sixty. Yeah, okay. seventy, sixty. It, it you're gonna have to. Um, to really find the right speed, you got to see if you're increasing or decreasing your speed till you get to the point where you're where you're kind of stable. Oh, Laramie's is Lurbu. Okay. Okay. So, uh, yeah, that's awesome lesson right there, folks. So when you get up to cruise, you got to bring back your engines. And you're Excellent. not tracking anything right now. Uh, FMS, I am. No, well, I'm supposed to be. Nothing. According to my map, I'm going direct to Welts on J105. And I'm doing. I'm in auxiliary nav. Hmm. What's it supposed to show? Are you looking at the enunciators or something? Well, usually, it usually give you a DME, maybe, but maybe I'm wrong. Oh, there's uh, Welts is a, just a waypoint. It's not a VOR. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, it's really slowing down. It's 285 knots. So I should probably give us yeah. a little more juice. Yeah. Now you're really slow. Yeah. That's the beauty of this bird, is you just really have to keep an eye on her. She will, she will, if you disrespect her, she will take your, your butt and put it into some fly paper. How no one's ever heard that going? phrase before. Uh, ground speed's only 250 right now, so I gotta increase things up. I'm gonna uh, bring arm spoilers. Spoilers armed. Yeah, spoiler chateau had it before I did. Yep. So serious gamer, you needed to buy the uh, 727 uh, uh, during the sale. So according to this, my calculations say that you did buy it on Friday. So if you can provide the last four uh, four digits of your order number here to Jack in the chat, he will confirm your July 28 purchase. Oh, I got some whispers. Yes, you do, Mini Webs. You have to be present to win. You should go to bed, man. I can't even, I, yeah, just go to bed. Although the Q400 is worth being tired tomorrow. Do you respond to whispers? <coughs> yep, yep, so computer fly I can confirm. Computer flying is confirmed. And JFM uh, and Shredder, we're only doing it for if you bought it during the sale. So is con is computer flying our first JFM millionaire as of right now? Can we get a JFM from computer flying? Because I think he just crossed uh, a mill for the first time ever. Anyone has ever done so? I think he did. I think he crossed a mill. Oh, he did! Congratulations, computer flying, the first John Fly millionaire. I think the closest to him is like 400k. Wow, nicely done. Here's your invisible trophy. <laughs> Pass it, man. Enhance the blaze. What, Max, what do you think of computer flying becoming the first John Fly millionaire? 
What do you think of the JFM program itself, Max? I can also confirm uh, I'm a serious I, gamer. Yeah, I love it. I I apps I, I love it. I um, I'm not a you know love at first sight kind of guy, but I think I think I have gonna change my view on that one. Yeah. Serious gamer, forty thousand added. Holy snack lips, we've got hundred and sixty in here right now watching. Sweet. Hello to everybody. Hello, welcome, welcome, welcome. We're flying the seven two seven. The route is KSGF to it's not to PHL. That's the wrong route. Who's running the overlay? Who's in charge here? Flight. STL. There we go. There's the proper route. Oh, and I also need to get the FSUIPC going because that's not tracking. Can I Amateur hour here. Andre. Ander. Andre. I don't know. Well, the R before the E always messes me up. Uh, How do you spell it? A N D R E underscore nine seven four. Forty thousand. Serious da gamers going to the store to buy some sounds. That's right. All right, let's check our speed now. Four forty. It's not bad. Four hundred forty knots across the ground. You need a special emote. Well, IAS, you're getting pretty high on the IAS. That's true. You need to bring that throttle back. Basically, look at your indicated airspeed and see if you're increasing or decreasing and get it down to about like 300 knots. But okay, just with okay. the throttle? Yeah. Okay. I don't want to get close to the barber pole, is what you're saying? What, yeah. uh, what kind of special emote do you want, computer flying? What what kind of theme do you want? Just curious. Stop looking at the ground speed. Ben Farney says. Okay. Yeah, you're supposed to look at indicated, right, Ben? He's trying to do the speed of sound. Yeah. In fact, you know yeah. what? I feel like a song is appropriate right now. Yeah. Let's let's play a song. Your Stand by for song. Going oh, snack. We got 372. 373. Blazing it. Blazing it. Set speed 310. Speed 310 knots. Delta 6799, LA Center, resume normal speed, climb and maintain, final 230. Normal speed, climb 230, compass 230. The JFM Million Club emote. Hmm. That's not a bad idea. Now you just adjust your speed until you're not increasing or decreasing to get your speed. Oh, 
Hold on. And I mean like small adjustments. Yeah, I... Yeah, I'm learning. 15, climbing 26. Number 300, golf mic, Denver Center, good afternoon. Hey, Simon, take a more up with the exit, we'll center walk. Climb and maintain, one second. Climb and maintain, flail 180, thanks, one second, brother. United 717, contact Phoenix approach, 128.65. 2865, United 717. LA Center, FedEx 12, 13, heavy, through 10, 5 for 14,000. Five Mike Whiskey, probably not a clip take off. Alright, clip take off runway 9 and uh, follow the short line eastbound. Five Mike Whiskey, thank you. Holy Center, United 1730, is out of 14.7 for 17,000. Alright, Mr. Chow. He's loving the new paint job. It's awesome. Thank you, Red Girl. That is John Fly, Into the Blue, the theme song. Such a great tune. Yes, I've been playing around with the adjustments here, doing IAS mode, doing pitch mode, just getting familiar with the bird. We're coming back up to 19,000. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do an, an, another altitude select arm. And then I'm going to watch my speed. We're in pitch control right now. Having fun. We are going to start our descent pretty soon. Nav log. Shows. Okay. We'll go ahead and start her now. All right. So. All right, Jack, so the best way to do descent is just uh, set my altitude and then uh, throttles back to idle. Set altitude 5,000. Altitude 5,000 feet. And throttles coming back to idle. All right, do I want to just descend in IAS mode or no? No. I guess I could. Yeah, I guess 280 to 10,000, then 250 all the way down to your okay. glide slope. All right, 280. Well, I'm going to go 275 just to be cool. You antisocial, you. You're a little hipster. Ha <laughs> <laughs> All right, so again, 727 and the Q400 are on sale. Get them now. You'll get 40,000 John Fly miles if you can prove the order made this weekend.
Let's see here. I will put a link to the song, possibly. I don't. I don't know if I have permission to distribute that song. I'm. I may put it on Discord. But yeah. How much is the custom emote? Is is the custom emote going for a million? JFM. Oh, we need to see the underside. We do. All right, the underside. Let's zoom in. Uh, detach from the aircraft. I think the PBR is playing around with this. But here are the logos of the GSA. So we got Twitch, YouTube, Discord, Facebook, Squirrel, Flight SciTech, VatSim, Giant Unicorn, Mr. Gibbs, Subject 89, 3 Green Gaming, Cirrus Max, Crazy. 3 Green Gaming is now Sapiens, though. M. Congrove, RDG, DH91. Tim, oh, we're making a turn. Yassine, Virus City, Sorcerer Dave, Lizbeth, uh, Chili Willies, AJ, Rob KBTL, Catch Trader, Marcus MMC, Uncertified, Cessna, Nightmare, Confliction. Nice logo bottom. Who? Me? Yeah, I don't. You haven't submitted your logo, have you, to the fly J or to the Discord room called GSA Logos? Have I, have I really? Is that really? Jeez. Yeah, there's a logos room. We can't we can't put it out there without uh, written consent, and you have to post the logo in the room. Hey, crooner seven seven seven, how are you? P3D people can't get this livery. No, they can't. Is there even a 727 in P3D? The Captain Sim, maybe. Okay. All right, we're passing through 14.6. And you said, uh, so 250 when I get below 10,000 is, is what we're thinking, right? Oh, look at, look at Cessna Rock's message to you, Jack. It's true. He did send me a message just a couple days ago, and I didn't respond to it. My bad. Cool. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are you still here? got some news. Oh, that I missed earlier. Oh, snack. It was up till 4 a.m. streaming. Ooh, I bet you're tired, crooner. Oh, yes. <laughs> Ooh, I got, I'm excited. Oh, I am excited. I have a, a I have an announcement to make when we uh, a very, very special announcement to make when we land. Oh, I just got some great news, folks. Oh, I got a call. Roger. I can't share the news until we land. Oh, this news is exciting, though, people. I'm not kidding. All right, so just to let you know, we're giving away a Q400. We're giving away a 727. We're giving away a Turtle Beach Pro headset. To This one will only go to uh, the United States of America, so just so you know. Sorry about that. Customs and shipping to outside the U.S. is very difficult. And, uh, yeah. 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 I think I have to give you a hot five for that. Hot five, hot five. <laughs> Only a hot five, though. Cessna rocks. Cessna rocks. It's pretty intuitive. A hot minus 595. The, Q, the Q400 and the 727 and the X-Plane or gift certificates, they can go international. Uh, juice. Juice? Is it juice? Uh, but yeah, the, the, ju the headset is only for domestic. It's very difficult for me and very expensive for me to ship outside of the United States a joystick. It's not cheap. 
his golf bet paid off. No, dang driver, that's a good point. Is the Canadian open? I think I'm going to win that bet with uh, Jamie. In fact, I should make a note. Ooh, that's exciting. Ah. This is this is very exciting. Woo. Okay, I gotta calm down and do this landing. Calm down, John Fly, calm down. Alright, I'm gonna slow let's see, I'm gonna I'm gonna go up to I Okay, so are you still on the phone, Jack? I'm backish, just doing something in the kitchen. Okay. Do you need uh, do you need my help? Yeah, I just wanna increase my oh. descent rate a little bit, so would what would be the best plan of attack to do that? Would that be spoilers uh, maybe coming in? I don't throttle in spoilers, yeah. Okay. And would I go in pitch mode for that? Or no? Still in IAS mode? Yeah, we're, we'll go to 250. That's fine. Yeah, 250 in IAS is fine. That you accidentally leaked the news, yeah, exactly. Hey, Moab Slayer, you can call me Kim, sure. Landing bets? Uh, sure. Uh, well, well, we'll have everyone post a guess. So post your guess in here. Closest landing rate will win. I don't really want to do the bets right now because the range is not uh, tweaked for... Um wow. You guys are going to love this announcement. we got a lot of things to do on the ground here in a bit. There you go, Zerg. We descended below where we were. Oh, I didn't arm it. Damn it. Okay. Let's get back up. Okay. I thought I had armed it. Let's do altitude select. And we'll go into pitch hold. And we're going to pitch up. And we're going to add throttle. Yep, that was my bad. Set nav one 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 zero point three. NAV one set to one one zero point three. All right, let's set course. Zero six three. Went the wrong way. Okay. Give me a second. I'll be away from chat for a bit. I gotta focus here. Okay, pitch hold. Let's go. Let's sync up our heading bug. And go into heading hold. Heading select. Okay, that's good. Actually, we're on a good course here, so 
Um, let's set our course. Six three. Verify nav radio one ten point three. Good. chart. Let's change our heading here just slightly. Oh baby. Comment on one thing. Yes, please. If you're so, you see your little speed bug on your speed there. Yep. The very last one is at 200 knots, right? Yep. If you're above that, the plane should be clean. If you're below that, you should have some flaps out. Okay. So flaps you were one. That for a flaps going down to notch one. Seven twenty seven is tricky like that. It'll you don't want to stall it. Just, that's a scary thing when you stall this plane. Yeah. I love this bird. It's so tricky. Tricky snicky. Watch the power. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go into Nav Loke. And we're going to get down, get down, get down, get down. John, serious face on. Coming into the loke. We can go flaps too. Oh, add a little speed. Little, little pitch control here. Arm spoilers. Spoilers armed. We'll stay at 4600 for right now. Should be at 5, but we're okay. We're fine. We'll intercept from below. Anything? Water? Look at this. Captain just got brought French toast. Oh, snack. Alright, watch your speed. Is that flight attendant going to bring me anything? Jeez. Yes. What, what, anything you'd like to order, she'll bring. I, I think I, I'm already good. I got the Kraken. I don't want to eat anything. <laughs> Okay, hopefully that localizer starts. Yep, 16 DME. It's good, it's good. 727 is a challenge to fly, without a doubt. Oh yeah, it's so fun though. I'm gonna change my heading just slightly. Better intercept here. Oh, we're actually... <laughs> pilot says now, pilot says now, says now, dude, now I'm hungry. <laughs> wow, breakfast before landing. Thanks for being in the chat room also. Okay, we should that that needle better start moving. Oh snack. We're a little high. Needle start moving. She's slippery. Twelve out. A little slow. Yeah. 
It's still slow, I think. Slow but high, because I'm in... Alright, let's push that nose down. Yep. Get speed. Let's trans yep. Translate altitude to speed, yeah? Yep. Oh, needle's coming in. I love it. The needle's coming in. The plane is turning. Oh, baby. Boom shakalaka. Ow, localizer. Baby. Little snack. Let's come down here. Let's go. Bam, bam. Bam right there. Oh, baby. All right, let's watch your speed. Oh. Landing gear down. Landing gear going down. Get your landing bets in now. If you did it earlier, don't worry about it. Oh, let's watch the bird. Watch the bird. Another notch of flaps. Keep our speed down. It's supposed to be at wood at 3,400. We're a little high, but we're good. Three green. I need to buy a. Is French toast on the checklist? I think it is. I'm gonna do it right now. Sorry. This could affect my landing rate, but. You are, you are above the glide slope right now. Yep. Or are I you am. on it? Is it attached? Yeah. Well, I don't know. No, it's not even armed. Okay. Why? Isn't it? Now it is. Okay. Now it's attached. Now it's good. Well, 30 seconds behind you, 20 seconds yeah, behind yeah. you. Oh, better watch my speed. Speed it up. Speed it up. Watch your speed. Good job. Good job. Good job. I'm setting my flaps. I'm getting this bird dirty early. Hand fly from 10 miles. No, thank you. I got French. If I didn't have French toast, I would maybe hand fly. You know, you can set your minimum decision altitude. With your radio altimeter? How do I do that? You know where your radio altimeter is? Nope. It's to the right. Oh, right of there. Yep. Okay. Uh, Decision. Set that yellow bug to 200 feet using the knob in the bottom right of the radio Thank altimeter. Thank you. That's what I use to disconnect my autopilot at 200 feet. Oh, my back hurts. I got stress in my upper back quadrant. Stress from the beauty of this situation. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I got some good news. Five miles out. Speed's good. Vodka and Diet Mountain Dew. Whew, that sounds like a good lunch. I can't drink here. It's 11.22 in the morning. Oh, baby. It's a pity there's not a golf course right around here. Mm. Yeah, did you open the V-card and set your landing? Nope. Set it to landing? V-card, landing, V-ref, 122, flaps 30. Okay. What is that? How do I set it? Oh, it's automatically. Once okay. you hit landing, it'll automatically set all of them. I'm screaming in, that's right. Well, I'm only at 160. 140 ground speed, actually. But I shouldn't look at the ground speed, Ben says. I feel like my nose is kind of in a... Oh, I better bet. Hold on. Got a case of 727 back because he's... <laughs> yeah. What should I land at? One V ref plus what? You can land right at V ref. And when you start your flare, you should be at V ref. And then you can go under that V ref as you flare, right? So you don't have to worry about that after you start your flare. Okay. We're one out. I'll go ahead and hand fly it now. DME looks good at one. Pitching for V ref. Get a feel for the birdage. Still on the slope. Pappies are happy. No, don't pitch for V-Ref. I know, I'm kidding. 
I know. You're just messing with no, me. No, I wasn't. Yes, <laughs> you're just messing. <laughs> <laughs> it's yelling at me. Glide slow, glide slow. Oh, snake. Oh, no. It was hard. Sorry, gentlemen. I should have disabled the plug-in. Max reverse, max reverse. Five thirty nine. Max breaking. Deploy. Bit toasty. Five mic whiskey. Jesus. I know. Don't. Yeah. Flap zero. Broke. Flaps going up all the way. Spoilers down. Spoilers already down. Landing lights off. Landing lights already off. <laughs> no, they're not. Who got the closer to that? <laughs> Whoever went highest. Cessna Rocks said 400. Yeah. Did he though? Did he? Two G's. Two G's on the G Force rating. Oh, wow. I, I see a 437. Don't taxi this way, by the way, folks. Driver. This is a special taxiway, only for me. Time for another drink. I'm on the ground. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it was a little hard. I. Uh, Cooper Dex at 490. Cooper Deck did. Cooper Deck 7 said 490. It's the highest one I see. Okay, 490 might win. I should have... Yeah. 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 That, that <laughs> what, was hard. What? Did you not hear the 50, 40, 30? Because you might have had your sounds too low. Maybe. That was an X-Plane one, so if you have your X-Plane sounds down. No excuse for that. But it, we had fun, regardless. I'm going to go up here and park. If you uh, didn't know about that, the when you start hearing the 50, 20, 30, whatever, the pitch of the sound actually tells you how fast you're going down. So if you hear 50... 20. You're going down really low. And if you hear 50, 20, then you're going really fast. So Ooh, yeah, that's like, a good point. So when you hear them, it, it really helps you with flaring. And that goes for every airliner, by the way, if you guys did not know that. Thanks, Moab Slayer, for the support. The, the psychological support. I'm just glad we didn't stall this plane and die at a taco stand. That's what I'm celebrating today. <laughs> if I have a vote to show a replay, I guess there's everyone's going to say, yeah, show the replay. Let's see how, how far those gears compressed. Yeah, let's see the, the, the shock absorbers. I won't do anything with the lights or any AP or anything. I'm just going to replay mode. This will give me a chance to eat some French toast for a second. All right, anyone else would like to give the last four digits of their order number to get 40,000 John Fly miles if you purchased a Fly JSM product this weekend? By the way, I'm rocking some new headphones on the, uh, on the John Fly stream. These are the Bose uh, SoundLink. Uh, on top of the ear, wireless Bluetooth headphones. They're really good. John I, like I just want to put it out there that I think it would be awesome if you played some multiplayer games with some of the other streamers. Like what? Which ones? Uh, maybe some of the racing games or since you have a wheel and maybe some Rocket League would be hilarious. Ooh, Rocket League might be kind of fun. Uh, I am yeah. doing multiplayer with the truck sim stuff. Um, oh yeah, I did see that. I do own a set of Corsa, so I should. It's just a matter of, I guess, finding the time and coordinating the multi-action. But uh, yeah, Rocket League sounds interesting. I should have picked it up on the cell. Or yes, like Lifesaver says, some player unknown battlegrounds. Mm -hmm, that would be insane to see you playing that. Actually, someone would have to teach me a lot though, because I, I I don't even know how to change weapons or. 
Oh yeah, the first time you, first twenty hours I played, I was Mister Hiding Out, trying to figure out what the hell I'm doing. <laughs> we did make our eye racing debut the other day on stream, by the way. Did you? Yeah. How'd that go? Uh, I'm learning. I really like the Charlotte track. I don't like Phoenix. Uh, the Mazda is a fun car, though. I'm trying to get up enough courage to go race real world, or not real world, but race online in a real race. See, even Valdu says, oh my god, John fa- playing in, in a first-person shooter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Getting fancy. Is fancy a, a, a phrase for fancy? Okay, here we come in. So right here, uh, yeah. I think I just... I don't know. I think I flared too late. Okay, right here. I'm coming in. The the angle of this camera makes the plane look gigantic. Oh, <clears throat> that wasn't as bad as the number portrayed. I mean, it was a little. <clears throat> Let's watch this. Nose is up. I landed. Oh yeah, that was hard. Never mind. <laughs> we'll just watch it in slow mo. I landed the right wheel first as well. That's totally fine. You could do that. That's legal. Compression, mostly on the right side, but all in all, not too bad. I mean, we, I don't think we died. Oh, no. It was definitely near the numbers. We, we, there is that part of it. Let's see what the uh, what the tower saw. Oop, tower does not have a good view. Yeah, it could have been worse. All right, who was the closest? Was it Cooper? Is that what we figured out? Yeah, Cooper deck seven. Okay. Not the closest. He's still making fun of me. I was going to give him a lot of John Fly Miles, but since he's been making fun of me, I'm just going to give him like 2,500. Oh, damn. Damn. 